Well, salute to Mondo there, chums. Tis I, captain of the station today, chums. I'm playing cyberpunk. Yes, because there's a new version. Version 2.0, people. Let me make this bigger on the screen. Now, if I press in R3 on this menu screen here, boom, look at this. This is everything that it entails. Unleash your inner road rage. Better sort of, you know, street fighting scenes when it comes to it. Just hanging out of cars. Become Night City's most wanted criminal. I don't know whether that appeals to me. Yep. And then we've got this one, survival of the fittest. Okay, cool. So it looks like you can reallocate your skill points all willy-nilly. Put your skills to the ultimate test. It looks like you've got full biomechanics now. It looks like they've removed perks from armor and put it directly into your your body frame and stuff. And higher stakes and encounters. Premier interactions? I think that's... Is that his Premier. Okay, fine. Anyways, let's close out of there. There's a few things I want to test. I'm going to be continuing my save. You can see here, I've got 97 hours in game. I'm not going to be starting a new save anytime soon, people. Okay, so the things I want to be testing right now. Well, hello there, our big pal. I'll let you know after he shuts up. Right, there you go, he shuts up. Awesome. Right, okay, well, you can see there's some missions have already popped up. So the sort of things that I want to be testing is, are the police as responsive as they should be now? And do they sort of just uh, go coo themselves all over the place? Huh? I just heard Johnny. What the fudge? Hello, Johnny. What are you doing here? Okay. Have they added in new stuff already? How do I talk to the guy? I haven't played this game for freaking ages, people. Okay, I guess I don't talk to him then? I've pressed every bloody button. Yeah, okay, cool. All right, fine. We're going out then. I guess I'm probably not going to go and meet Hanako at um, Embers because that's that's kind of end gamey type stuff. Where's the map? There's also a uh, a quest that was stuck, and for whatever reason I couldn't get it to work. Um, so here we go. Not that one. Here we are. Has it actually completed now? Have I actually done every single one? Because there was a um, cyber punky type guy. You know the cyber, they, they've gone crazy in the head. Cyber psychos. There was one of those that wouldn't actually complete. Okay. It looks like they have all completed now. Which means I've completed every mission in the game. Nice. So that's actually fixed. That's one of the things I wanted to test was, is there any progress blockers now? Looks like that's all been fixed coated. Sweet. This would be a fast travel out here, isn't there? Is that a fast travel? No, that's a salivander. I can't remember anything. Here we go. Here's the fast travel. See what I mean? I haven't played this for freaking ages. Track job. A new job. Okay. Upgrades. Read the message from such and such. You know what? I haven't played this for such a long time. Anyway, we're just going to teleport there. And hopefully cause a little bit of a ruckus. I need to find out how to draw my gun again. I, I seriously haven't played this for like a good eight to ten months. I don't remember many of the controls. I remember some of the basics. The controls. Out of the freaking window, mate. Okay, so here we are. This is my gun. It's a freaking awesome gun. Okay. Let's go find somebody to shoot in the head. Okay. Now, this is version 2.0, and I've already spotted some weird jankiness. I mean, what exactly is he sitting on? Is he supposed to be sitting on the curb? Because he, he really isn't. Hello, mate. Oh, fuck. Oh, he actually pulled a gun out on me. Did you see that? Yeah? How? Freaking have it, mate. All right. Okay, now normally police officers would just Goku. They would just sort of appear, instant translocation, right onto your location. Now it looks like they arrive in cars. Awesome. Hello, police officers. Ah! Got a oh, yeah. And oh. they've got me. Okay, this feels a lot better. This does feel a lot better. 
Sweet! Okay, cool. Okay, obviously I'm not going to go to Hanakosa Embers. That's the last mission. I've already done it a fair few times. And there's different sorts of um, things going on there. Kabayan Foods. Okay, interesting. This place looks freaking awesome, doesn't it? I swear this looks sharper than what I remember. This looks bloody awesome, doesn't it? Now, something that I've not seen on console, but I see on PC all the time, is you see all these sort of like railings up in the air, these sort of like giant scaffolds. Well, they're actually for the monorail. And in the PC, you see the monorail actually using them. In the whole time that I've been playing, the whole 97 hours on actual console, I don't think I've ever seen a monorail car fly along these. And, uh, yeah, it doesn't seem to be that they're doing it now either. On PC, you stand here for, what, about five five minutes, you're definitely going to see one. I don't think that's true. I don't think the end cart system is actually here at the moment. Why are these guys hiding? What's going on down here? Who are they shooting at? Do you need us some help? NCPD! Here you go. I'll give you a help. Oh, what the fudge? The cops are shooting at me now. Okay, you go down a lot quicker in this new update, I'm telling you. That's that's insanely quick. Normally, I'm like a freaking tank. That's mental. Okay, so the main reason I'm playing this anyway is because there's a new DLC bundle coming out soon. And I'm hoping to hit that up and play it. So, yeah, that's, that's pretty much why I've, I've downloaded this again and trying it again. And I'll tell you what, it's it's a heck of a lot better, isn't it? I might sleep until morning, come to think of it, though. So you can see all this city in all of its glory, heck yes. Hello there, V. Right, if I can remember where my bedroom is. <laughs> oh, yeah, it's just over here, isn't it? Yeah, there we go. Yep, go to bed. Lovely jubbly, have a bit more of my tea. Hmm. Okay, what time? What, um, what time? I, I, I only want to wake up around. Yeah, there. That do me. I think that's new as well, isn't it? Sweet. Oh, what a beautiful morning! Oh, what? have I been running around in my boxer shorts all this time? Anyway, let's have a little gaze out of the window. Look at that city. It's freaking mental, isn't it? Yes, I've got a pet cat somewhere in here as well. I haven't fed it since February, but it's still alive somehow. Right, I'll show you my character in the mirror as well. So you can see how awesome my character looks. There you go. So yeah, it's still got his hat on. But why the fudge am I pretty naked? That's a bit mental, isn't it? So yeah, there's all my appearance. Little looking pretty darn suave. Nice one. Yeah, I'm fine with that. But I, 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 I need to work out why I'm not wearing anything. That's 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 the weird thing. Have I been running around this whole time getting shot and murdered? Yeah, stop looking yet. Yeah. Come on, let's get out of here. Um, that's a bit weird. Uh, that could be why I'm dying so bloody quick. Character reset. Due to significant changes in gameplay mechanics, your perks have all been reset and your perk points have been run refunded. No wonder I've been like glass. Okay. Oh, fudge and heck. This would take me ages to pump all of these into here. People and get myself ready for the update. And I don't think it's going to be all that good for you guys to watch me allocate all my skill perks. And, and I've got to think this one through. I'm not going to rush it. Well, I'll do that, chums. Well, I'm back into Cyberpunk and I've actually allocated all of my, well, a lot of the attribute points. I haven't gone to town and put them all in because I've actually run out of perk points now. But I found that what you need to do is upgrade your attribute points in the skill that you want to, un to move this bar further up to unlock the next skill. So say if I wanted to unlock all these skills in here, I'd allocate my um, attribute points into there all the way up to nine to get to the next level like so okay 
So you need to your attribute points are quite important to unlocking tiers. So where I've gone crazy is in at the moment into the actual call area. Just because I wanted all of these sort of pistol mechanics to make myself a little bit better with pistols. So I think I'm doing fairly good now. Um, I don't really see the point in allocating much else in here. I mean, I could stick that into there, I suppose. There you go. That's all my perk points allocated. I haven't quite gone to town with my attribute points yet. I'm still not 100% where I want to drive my build. Um, but there's a whole load of new skills inside of here, people, that are related to cars. Now, I've heard that this new update that's coming, there's a lot of car missions to actually steal cars. And that's the way that you get cars now, is to actually steal them and do an activity or something. So every time I've seen an area where there's a low tree area for cars, like there's one there as well, see? I've gone in and at least got that skill unlocked, you know, just in case it's a big part of the update. Anyways, we're now fully upgraded, people. It's still daytime. Johnny's there. I've now put on all of my um, gear. Um, what I haven't done, though, is put in my secondary weapons. So I quite liked my sniper rifle. Pow. And I quite liked my a big shotgun that blows stuff to smithereens. I haven't put anything into um, shotguns at the moment. But sniper rifles I have and also revivers I have. So there we go. That's my favourite one there. Pow! Okay, right. And uh, let's, let's head on out then. And uh, I head on back down to the street scene. And we'll see how we do now. Let's just fast travel down there. I can't be arsed with lifts and things. So here we go. Let's just... Let's just go straight outside again. We'll go straight back to where we were before. And I'll shoot a police officer and we'll see how long I last this time, people. Right, oh, well, it cut to another freaking loading screen, but there we go. I'm, I'm in now. Right. Oh, holy fudge, I got hit by a car. I wonder what the fudge happened then. All right, okay. How do I change weapons? There we go. We've got my pistol again. The guy sitting on the curb isn't there. Any any old police officers? I suppose I could just shoot a civilian. <laughs> okay. Pow. You're dead. I like that it sets them on fire now. That's pretty darn cool. Right, hopefully they're going to send some police officers my way. Um, there's a police officer over there. They didn't send a police officer at me, did they? Whoops, wrong button. Okay, well, we'll use this giant shotgun on the cop car. Kaboom! That was a police officer's car, but... Ah, fudge. Who got me? Oh, look, there's a freaking street vendor that's taking a pop at me. What the actual fudge? Fucking... <laughs> Oh my days, that took a few limbs off, didn't it? Okay, cool. Um, coppers, coppers anywhere. Some ammo here. Sweet. Yeah, we'll take that. I thought I'd completed everything, but maybe they've added a few more gigs in. Okay, let's uh, go up here then. I think. Lovely. Oh, something's just happened. I've upset somebody. Have that. Now this used to be a one-hit kill before this gun. It isn't anymore, and they're completely annihilating me. This is weird. I need to find out why I'm so freaking glass-like. I mean, I put in all my points. This shouldn't be a thing. Hmm. All right, well, maybe I need to go see a Ripper doc or something. Look at my cyberware. Because this is... I'm getting brutalized. Okay, chums, I've found probably the most shadiest Ripper doc in the world. Let's head on and then. Let's go see this guy. I don't know whether I trust this. Okay, looking to get chipped. Okay, so it looks like I haven't got anything plugged in right now. Okay. Confirm. 
Now I had quite a lot of cyberware already. Um, this is a bit, a bit weird, isn't it? I'm, I'm really not sure on any of these new mechanics. To be, to be honest, people. Okay. So it looks like a lot of these are related to perks as well. Holy mackerel. Okay. So, yeah. This is um, some of the armors that I had before, I think, people. Yeah. So all the armor is now going... And rather than going into your clothing, it goes into here. By this slot, I want to put something in there. Okay, right, so that's a lot of it in. Um, let's get that in then. Oh, you can just swap along the here. That's that's different. I have no idea what a lot of these things are. I'm just clicking on them for fun. Sweet. I, hopefully I'm putting in good stuff. I mean, they, they do have little mini write-ups, but yeah, they all look freaking awesome. What can I put into here? Are these ones I own or something? I think they're the ones I actually own. Shite, man. Got loads going on here. Whoops. So you just have to click. I can take it. Um, I'll stick that one in then. That one. Oh, okay. Now I want to go onto this one. And I put that in. I'm just looking at this bar at the side and trying to make it go up as high as possible. So that's already cool. I can buy that, I guess. Nope, I haven't got enough money, I guess. Don't have enough eddies. This has got extra slots in it yet. Sweet. Okay, can I put that on it? No, 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 no. That wants to stay in. Okay, arms. I could go for gorilla arms. Is this the gorilla arms? Yes, that's the one that I would like. Base, this is all cool. I've got my optics in. Yeah, that was minus, minus. I'm doing good. I've got everything I need in there. Everything I need there. Okay, hopefully now I'm not so glass-like. Um, I've fully upgraded my suit by the looks of things. I need to get up to the next level at some point, but there you go, that's that's pretty much me done. Right. Now let's see how glass-like I am, shall we, people? I love the adverts and they're so freaking crazy. And the fact that there's no loading screens going in and out of buildings and stuff like that, it's freaking awesome, isn't it? All right, can I make a quick save at this point? Save game. Here you go, let's just save there. Confirm. Sweet. Okay. Yeah, Phantom Liberty I've already got on pre-order. Let's see how I do now, people. Right, that should bring in some coppers. Here we go, police officers. Still not one hitting these guys, am I? Take that. What the fudge? Okay. Ah. 
Take that, coppers! Oh, great, I think I shot myself there. Alright, okay, so I'm less glass like now, but at the same time, I'm still not as OP as I was before. I was, I was freaking like Terminator, and then some before people. Now I'm slightly less. But you know what? It is what it is. Um, so yeah, there we go. We've got got a lot of stuff all in, improved and installed. So yeah, you know what? I think I'm now ready for the update in a roundabout way. And hopefully we're going to get some more perk points and allocation points. And hopefully I can put them into body. Hopefully make myself a little bit less glass-like. But right now I'm still a gun-wielding freaking ninja. I've just got to be a little bit more careful with who I pick a fight with. And that's pretty much it. Job complete. Upgraded you. Nice one. Alright, okay. Well, I'm just going to make another quick save anyway, people. Not that I really need to. And um, I think I'm going to be calling this a day at this point in time. Unless I just jump on over. So yeah, looking forward to Phantom Liberty. Uh, the whole new skill tree and the way you allocate things and the way that they put it all in the cybernetics now feels a little bit more immersive to the actual game. It, would, it might be an idea to start a new game, but I don't really want to after putting 98 hours into this save. So I'm just going to carry on with what I'm doing. But as you can see, I'm almost like a noob jumping back into this because I've got to relearn everything. But it's fun. I'll see you for the, the uh, Phantom Liberty update when it comes out in a couple of days. Well, I think it comes out tomorrow, in fact. I've already got it pre-installed. It's ready to rock and roll. So hopefully you're going to join me for that. I'll do a few episodes alongside my um, No Man's Sky content and also Starfield. It's getting pretty busy over on this channel at the moment, people. I was doing two videos a day. It could be that I'm doing three a day now. One for Cyberpunk, one for No Man's Sky, and one for Starfield. We'll see how we go. Anyway, until next time, goodbye, goodbye, and goodbye again.